Look, with the beef, you also asked me about the beef situation with Coast and all of that. Everything we do is exaggerated to the T because of like, the, we want to entertain the people. Yo, yo, my people, it's your boy EB the Kid. Welcome to another episode of The Kid Show. Today, I am joined by a man from the JHB. I flew yes, in sir. like a bad B, bro. Yeah. How are you, brother? I'm, I'm blessed, man. I'm good, man. I feel like an Instagram battery right now. Ah. Uh. Being flown out and shit to Cape Town. Ah, crazy. Yeah, just watching for my ASOS baits and shit, man. All right, obviously chilling in the section, huh? Yeah, man. What do you think about that, though? What do you think about the Instagram baddies just um, hey, being scary. spoiled? Hey, scary! Is it scary? Scary. Would you would you date the girl that um, has been spoiled? Um, by the foreign nationals, maybe sometimes the older white men. Dog, maybe all hands will get spoiled by those people if they're around the area. I mean, the what, like around the circle. So, like, if a girl goes to a club, she's definitely going to get spoiled by a thingy. It's mm. just that she shouldn't be like getting flown out. That's crazy. If you're getting flown out, why, why why is that crazy? It depends, bro. Like if it depends. No, that's crazy. Nah, that's crazy. You can't get thrown out, no? Nah? But not someone that's like unless you're like trying to actually be in a relationship with someone, then that can make sense. You know what I'm saying? Uh, your but type you can't, is your type. But you can't But get not just that. Uh, now cause the brew wants to act like he has money now. Oh, let me fly you out. Uh, please. None of that, no? No. Okay. Serious. You have to respect yourself. Come on, guys. So this is King Omar, uh, yeah, one of the sorry. biggest YouTubers in South Africa right now. <clears throat> the biggest. The biggest. Yeah. I thought Ghost is the biggest. Numbers don't mean anything, bro. Ah. Uh, the biggest, the greatest. They call uh, me the father. Ah, uh, crazy. Yeah. Uh, obviously, the the, the the king of smashing pause. Yeah. The king of YouTube in general. In general. Yeah. What's your what's your what's your highest YouTube video on YouTube? Smash a pass. How much? How much views? Uh, I think we're going for one point one or something. One for one million. Yeah. Yo, crazy, bro. I haven't even touched five hundred. Damn, really? Yeah, I'm still working, bro. That's crazy. But you, but you, I thought, bro, like, I thought you'd be on the moon right now. Nah, I'm working, bro. But listen, bro. Um, for those people that don't know him, he's from Johannesburg. Yeah. He came up doing a whole lot of shit. Why do I swear? I've never sworn on this podcast. You're the first person ever got me to swear. Yeah, you got comfortable. Around yeah, me. I'm comfortable. Around <laughs> you. All right. So, bro. Where did it all start, bro? YouTube. We're gonna, we're gonna. I want, I want short answers though because I have a lot to ask you. Hey, sh- I like my things long, but okay. Whoa, that's kind of sus, dog. No, I'm talking about like the rounds. Oh, bro, the ra- what the rounds, nigga, bro? bro? Chill out. Hey, sh- that nigga, <laughs> <laughs> that nigga got me. <laughs> he be the kid, man. Shout yeah, out. man, crazy. So, where did it start, bro? YouTube. Where did YouTube start? YouTube uh-huh. started um on vines. You know what I'm saying? We used to do vines back you in the do day. Vines? Uh, I'd say we probably uploaded like three, four vines, and at the time we started, like I think two months later, it got like banned or like stopped working or something. Yeah, people didn't do vines anymore. No, the, the app actually shut down. Why? I have no idea. I, I, something of they got bankrupt, but it doesn't make sense because we're making so much money. I think maybe they just liquidated, bro. You know, when you make so much money, you're like, ah, uh-uh, let me just take all let this money. Let me just stop, yeah. I'd be good, you yeah. know, set for life. I think what, that's what they did. I don't think they went bankrupt because Kim Bash damn near a millionaire because of Vine, so. Yeah. Yeah. And then you were doing the public interviews as well. Yeah, that was, uh, yeah, I feel like that's when I actually started doing, like, actually YouTube. Yeah. Because back then we just used to do, like, funny skit videos and stuff like that and just upload them on YouTube. But actually being an actual, like, YouTuber mm-hmm. was when we started doing the public interviews where we used to go to malls and stuff like that where we used to publicly interview people. That was, that was dope. It was a good time, man. Mm. So, yeah. Bro, and on school, though, were, were you popular in school? Did yeah. Because on school, no, yo, what? King Omar's going to be popular one day. What, nigga? Bro, like, since grade nine, bro. We used popping. to show with like the matrix and shit. Yeah, <laughs> that's that's how you that's that's how you measure your cool level, no? Yeah, though we used to, we those niggas when they ask like, yo, let's in, initiate someone, they'll come to ask us who don't we like. Oh, and so they can initiate them. Yeah, that's that was crazy. Us. Although they already initiated us by then, cause you know what I'm saying. Mm. To be a part of the cool kids, you gotta you know go through some things. You know what I'm saying. Yeah. So were you were you um, getting a lot of goals in school? No. What? Nah. Nah. <laughs> No bitches. <laughs> and it goes single as hell, man. She, why? Um, why do you think that is? I don't know, to be honest. I feel like, um, I don't know, maybe the area we grew up in, like, we didn't, we probably bloomed late a lot in our area. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, that's where, how I grew up. We bloomed late. Like, all these things, people are be like, oh, no, I did this in grade nine, grade eight. Okay, Kevin. So we're, not, we're literally still sweating, playing soccer, gym breaking, yeah. nine. What do they mm. mean you're doing those things? Bro, like, we didn't think that far yet. So, I don't think I was getting girls like that until probably, like, first year. First year, and you yeah. went uni? Yeah. Why, why, why did you study at uni? 
did I study just a question? What I'm supposed to be studying? <laughs> <laughs> uh, logistics. I was supposed to be doing logistics. Wait, uh, what do you mean? UJ. UJ? Yeah. I, mean, I, like this. I heard UJ is sus though. No, I ain't. I heard UJ is like... UJ is number one university in South Africa, so get your facts right. Come on, bro. This yeah. flipping UCT or you smoking crack? Yeah, no, go check the stats. UCT though. UCT. Would you rather go to UCT or UJ? I'd go to UCT just because um, I'd be far from Joburg and I've been in Joburg all my life. Yeah. But I'm sure if I was in Cape Town, I was going to be like, nah, I want to go to like UJ. Or nah, maybe, maybe I'm mistaken, but I saw a lot of stuff on um, like TikTok and stuff about UJ. They say it's not the place to be. They say it's a bit sus. I mean, at least people, they graduate. Mm. So that's dope. You know, people at uh, UCT and uh, Vids, hey. <laughs> yeah. Stuff, no? Is that they've been there or they dropped out? <laughs> <laughs> so what uh, made you drop out? What made me jump out? I just feel like, to be honest, like, I'll tell you guys a story. One day, um, like, the, a person from, like, uh, a logistics firm came to, like, speak to us. and be like, yo, this is what's going on with logistics, A, B, C, yeah. D. Um, this is what you can potentially be making. This is how much he was making, you know. And he was talking about how much, like, obviously, like, he made on a good month and, like, in a good year. And then... At that time, by the time he told us that that thing, I wasn't making money from YouTube. So I was like, okay, now nah, this is dope. You know, yeah. I'm saying the vision is, is was small at that time. I was like, okay, cool, this is dope. I do logistics, YouTube on the side, that'd be good. You know what I'm saying? Mm. And then I think how much did he say you'd make though as a logistic man? How much is he making? I, thought, I think he was talking about like he doing like fifteen to I think on a good man he was doing twenty five. Twenty five, but obviously you make that yeah. with one post, no? No. no, not one post, bro. Maybe like half a video, not a full one. Half a video. Yeah. yeah. One, one post, 25. I'll quit, bro. Who's <laughs> <Just> doing that? <laughs> Big YouTuber. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, my yeah, God. But no, but, but genuinely, like, after I heard, like, the numbers you were talking about, and after that, um, after a few months of working on YouTube, and then after that, I was making plus minus really what he was talking about. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? I'm just like, ah, dog, this is just the beginning. Mm. And if this is what I'm going to do for three years just to do that in my first year, I will just leave that and like focus on this and try to push for longer. Mm. Like the only the only thing that was dope about university is the form of security. And personally, me, I don't like that thing of like depending on something or yeah. someone. Mm. You get what I'm saying? So it's like I never liked that factor already. So I didn't want to do it just because I might fail. I never have that mentality like, oh no, let me just go get this degree in case things, other things don't work out in life. No, what the fuck? Mm. Shit is gonna work out. <laughs> it better work out. Yeah. If you don't work out, I'm gonna make it work out. For me, for me also, um, what I probably miss, I wouldn't say miss, but what I think about a lot, like of maybe having a normal job, mm. is security dog, like yeah. you know your your taxi's paid for you. I hope you're paying your taxes firstly. No, nah, I don't do that. <laughs> Chill out, bro. So I was going to come off to you, bro. I'll pull up, bro. Whatever you need, so I got you. Money ain't an issue. <laughs> yeah, but... <laughs> I'm joking. Hey, hey relax. I'm broke. <laughs> so... you not my real life. That's probably what I must... I would like... So as does... Like, your company does your tax for you. You know you're putting in money for retirement, all that stuff. You know at the end of the month, you're going to get money. But right now, we like... We like in the jungle, bro. You have to go hunt for your money. But at the same time, it's like... But it's obviously it's obviously a lot more worth it. Like we mm. we probably have better opportunity and we don't have a ceiling. But people who are working exactly. like have a ceiling, a big ceiling, mm. and you can't just come out of it. And the, and you know what the issue about it is like when you get in, yeah, you can't come out. You can't come out. And I think I I didn't believe that thing. I was like, nah, niggas are lying, bro. Niggas can go work for three years, four years, get their bag, blah blah, whoop this, and start whatever they want to start. I've seen so many people. Yeah. Like so much people with so much potential to be like pushing like like a hustle or whatever it is, now And just the fact that they've worked a nine to five before, mm. like they 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 scared. So when they go push the hustle, like when it's just about to like hit the peak or like about to like you know what I'm saying. Like you can see like okay now nah, cool in the next three four four months you're gonna be good you know. Although yeah. uh, maybe those months you're gonna suffer or whatever you're gonna be good like eventually. They won't be able to. It was that fact that I just go back to 95. But I think I think for us it might be a bit easier though. Like for me, for instance. Mm. Like luckily for me, I was I, I studied, I I finished studying. I done a diploma, two year diploma yeah. in sports management. Okay. Yeah, obviously an educated voice. People don't know that, but now you know. But yeah. for for us, I feel like it might be a bit easier than someone that's older than us. Yeah. Because we're still staying at home. Our parents yeah. are still paying the rent. So we had the opportunity to push our potential. Yeah. To try no, but at the same time, I am I am talking about people who are still 
what's one called at, at like your parents i'm talking about like people our age group i'm not talking about uh 20 35 years old dog at that time dog if you haven't figured it out by then stick to your nine to five yeah you know so you're obviously speaking about people our age yeah i'm talking about like people who are trying to still like build Elevate, that foundation yeah. mm-hmm, mm-hmm. you know that's the people i'm talking about mm, crazy so guys bro if you guys wanna wanna reach a level where there's no limit mm. You gotta, you gotta chase your dream, bro. You have to. You can't just stay in. But, but maybe ninety five makes you happy. If ninety five makes you happy. Stay on that, bro. I don't believe so. You don't believe ninety five makes anyone happy. I don't think so. Like, I'd say a ninety five can make you happy, but doing what you love can make you happy. Like, so let's say you're an accountant. You yeah, know what I'm saying, bro. The biggest accountants don't work nine to five. Mm-hmm. They don't. It's just facts. They work for themselves. Yeah. And they, they do their own private shit or whatever, blah, 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 whoop this. But I don't believe that, like, you working for someone, that, that shit can't make you happy. Mm, mm. Crazy. So, bro, I want to ask you, no? You made quite a bit of money. Nah, not even. I mean, like, decent amount of money. Let's be serious for once, Omar. Omar likes to, Omar, Omar likes like, to have these people. If you have to say compared to other people. <laughs> <laughs> You're not making a lot of bread. Huh? But, but. No, I'm saying, like, compared to, like, the average person my age should be making, I ain't making a lot. But, like, compared to what money actually is, I ain't making nothing. Yeah. That's what I'm you. just trying to say. I totally understand you. Yeah. Now, this obviously started somewhere. There was a yeah. lot of elements to you blowing up. A lot. A lot of elements. Mm. Like, people think it's just smash and pass. Yeah. But it's not smash or pass, smash and pass, smash or pass. Smash or pass. Smash or pass. Yeah. So, people think it's just that. But I saw a lot of different elements in terms of, like, beefing. Yeah. YouTubers. Yeah. Now, just that you guys are cool now. Yeah. Was Ghost also one of the niggas you, you beefed with? Yeah, for a little bit, yeah. And who was, was the other one? Was there more? You guys you guys in Joe Book are doing lots of beef there, right? No, no, I feel like it's like well, how I see beefs is just like, bro, everyone goes through problems. Yeah. Dog, like, I fight with my friends all the time. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. It's just that now that we are internet people, We'll throw it on the internet so it makes it look like a big deal. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, like, let's say now, because um, the thing is now, also with the people I've beat with, you'll always see, like, we, we were always close before the beef happened. Because, mm-hmm. like, okay, we're cool, we're cool, we're cool. Then one small thing will happen. I'm like, ah, actually, nah, I don't fuck with this guy no more. And after that, cool, we'll go through YouTube, we'll do it back and forth. Because that's, that's our life. You know yeah. what I'm saying? We record our daily lives and everything. So we go back and forth, telling our people what's going on right now, the situation. And then eventually, like, ah, you know what? That situation's not even that deep. Yeah. And so it's cool, you know? So you're saying it's not it's not fake? Because a lot no. of people are saying these niggas are just beefing every single week. No, I just, feel like... Just, just, just to get views. I feel like the emotions behind it were real. Yeah. But obviously they were exaggerated. Mm. You know? Mm. So it's like saying, like, name up when you get scuffed, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool, he's gonna he obviously did get kicked, but then he got dived. Yeah, yeah. You get what I'm saying? It's that type of thing. Okay, crazy. Now straight in onto the fake stuff. On the fake stuff. We're gonna yeah. stay on it. Um there's a lot of niggas in Joburg, many YouTubers that fake a lifestyle to get views. Mm. Now I wanna I wanna understand, at least we we assume they fake a lifestyle with the pranks, with the new whoops. So, like, what's real and what's not, bro? Maybe you can give us some insight on what's real and what's not. Bro, is everything no, real? Nothing or? Nothing on the internet is real. Mm. Nothing at all. Even when we do, even like yourself, you know, when you do genuine videos and genuine content, like, if you really want it to blow up, you got to tweak it a little bit. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So, like, let's say now um, you, you maybe do a public interview. Yeah. And someone's, they don't even kiss, but they were about to kiss. You're going to put that snippet of you about a kiss on the snippet. Yeah, I get And you. even tightly they kissed. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. To get the views and the numbers and all of that. So what I say is like, dog, like not everything is truly real, but percentages of it is, is real. real. So like, it's like, let's say, um, um, let's give an example. The car, let's, let's talk about the car, um, Ghost Luby car. Yeah. There was lots of, there was lots you of see? controversy so, about it. Like I'll tell you right now, hey, Ghost, don't sue me for this, but yeah. What goes, what he does, goes has money. Like, people don't get it. Ghost has a lot of money. Yeah. You, you get know, what I'm saying? I would know that as a YouTuber. Exactly. Based on the amount of views he has. And you know, he, talking about that, now I can, let me give you a little bit of insight. Yeah. Ghost is going to kill me for saying this, but what's this thing called? Ghost makes more money through the shit that he does than what it makes on YouTube. 
what shit he does. I'm not going to say it, obviously, because that's his personal business. Yeah. Never ready to tell people that, you know what I'm saying? Mm. Just, just, just a businessman. You yeah. get what I'm saying? So, like, the, the what's so called the business that he does makes him more money than actually YouTube. And now you're saying that you know that it makes a lot of money because of YouTube. YouTube yeah. Now I'm telling you, YouTube is his second form of income. Mm. Now think of how much money Ghost has. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's crazy. Mm. But 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 I want to understand why why Sima had a call and then she didn't have a call. Like, where did that That's come? what I'm trying to say. Like, things are like, it happens but doesn't happen. You get what I'm saying? Because Ghost has three cars right now. Yeah. And that's facts. That's facts. You get what I'm saying? Mm. But like, the thing of like, uh, maybe let's say today gets this car. Because Ghost, bro, like Ghost can change cars every week and he'll actually buy them. Cash. He'll buy them like, ah, dog, I'm tired of this M4, dog. Ah, I'm telling you guys right now, uh, a little insight, uh, Ghost don't sue me. But another few weeks and stuff, he'll change a car. And then you'll see another one, you'll be like, hey, but no, what's going on? It's real, those things. Don't mm. don't think he's playing games. He's buying those cars. He likes what's called flipping cars. I get you with that. But mm. why did the wife have the car and then she didn't have the car after that? That's what we're trying Probably to understand. Probably sold it after. To, Probably because sold. after he, he was in call, after she didn't get a, fo- a car, she, didn't have, she doesn't have a car no more, he gets an M4. Mm. And our M4 is probably the same value of all those three other cars he had Combined. at the time. Yeah. So it's like, okay, cool, makes sense. It's not like the money is like disappeared. You know, it's like a thing of like, let's say today, um, I'm a soon call, I tell you guys, okay, cool, I put an M4, boom. And then tomorrow I'm saying, okay, the M4 is gone, but I have a, a one series. Mm. That doesn't make sense. Yeah. Because it's like, dog, how you go from M4 to one, one series? series? That's like far off. But I think it had a three series, had a GTI, had a, a Mercedes. All those things combined, could be the price of the M4. So you're saying he sold all the other cars to buy the M4? Yeah. Mm. I, well, I know he definitely sold two of them. I don't know, but the third one. Mm. Yeah. And the house. Huh? the house? The house? I thought the house was fake, bro. Come on. The house is fake. That's Airbnb shit, man. Come on. <laughs> he even said it, though. He, he was, it. yeah, he dropped the video saying the guy was Airbnb. He was crying even. Uh, he didn't I see the thumbnail. <laughs> so, 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 <laughs> those thumbnails are intense, no? Yeah, bro, Ghost is the best, bro. Uh, guys, <laughs> guys, please tell Ghost to tell me money, now. Yeah? He has my banking details. Just DM him. Say, hey, send him all my money. Oh, yeah. But, this uh, is back, by the way. Shout out to Ghost. I saw you sneaking into the thing as well. Yeah. You snuck into the house. No, yeah. it's fake. No, like the house. Yeah. That was Airbnb. Ah, okay, okay. I get you. Yeah. The mm. bro told me to pull up and stuff. I was supposed to pull up the next day. Mm. You know, so he sent me everything, like, yo, bro, pull up, blah, 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 whoop this. But I didn't tell him, I'm like, I'm on my way, tight shit. I didn't tell him, like, I'm outside or whatever. So when I got in, I just jumped in. Mm. And then he's like, oh, shit, you here? Dope. But he knew I was coming, but he just didn't know when I was coming. Oh, uh, so you snuck in. Yeah, so um, I snuck in. Oh, yeah. so it's, it's real, but it's not. Real. Exactly what I'm trying to say. Uh, I get you, I get you. It's not like I randomly came out of the blue or the location came from the sky. No, he knew I was coming, but he didn't have what time. He didn't have, hey, I'm at the door. Nah, he just, oh, boom. Dog, you here? Mm. Even if you check the video, he was like, you here? It's not like, oh, my God, how do you know if I'm here? It's like, you here now. You know? uh. So yeah. Okay, so you must always read the fine films of the Joburg YouTubers. No, guys, this th- guys, bro, let me tell you something, bro. YouTube is a movie, dog. You watch to enjoy. Now it's like saying now if I bring out a ghost that I edited in my video, you're gonna start telling me my ghost is fake. Obviously, my ghost is fake, but where you think I'm gonna get a ghost from? Hey, so yeah. it's like, dog, come on, just watch to enjoy, dog. Don't yeah. watch to inspect, dog. Just yeah. have fun with it. Just laugh. Mm. You if you laugh, just know your day is made. Now other people that are watching to hate. Hey, sh- just I watch the ads I, I, too. I don't hate though. I don't hate though. I can't lie. Yeah. I just I just want to find out information. I just want to find out like what what's actually happening. I want to understand what's happening behind the scenes. Mm. I'm a YouTuber myself. Yeah. No, I, I get it. I get it. I get it. It's just that I like, would like an M4 too though. But yeah, you're saying, bro. I don't understand. You oh, bought, oh, oh, an RS5. Yo. You you bought a BM. Ghost. I'm stealing one of your cars. You bought a BM though. Yeah, I got a BM. How how was that? How, how, did it take you a long time to save up? Did you buy cash? How was it? <laughs> you know what's crazy about it? I'm gonna give you guys some juice. Eh? Yeah. Um, I bought the BM because I felt like I needed a car. It's not. I bro, let me tell you something about me. I don't save. You don't save? Not at all. Like oh. if I want something, I'll work to get it. So like, let's say, um, you tell me, hey, poison, let's go to Dubai. Mm. How much do I need for Dubai? You tell me fifty thousand. I say always give me a month. I span work hard. My check says 50k. Boom. I go to Dubai. It's not a thing of like, obviously, I have money in the bank. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So that money, I don't use it. Touch shit. Mm-hmm. Like, I don't touch that money. That's probably for other stuff. But I don't say, like, yo, I need a car. Let me save for a car. No. If I need a car, I must get something to get that car. Mm-hmm. Not 
old money. I don't eat old money. Oh, so you you so, you hustle you hustle in the in the. In if I want money, if I want a car in June, I must span from now to June to get that money to get that car. I get you. Mm. Mm. Your only is really pushing PR. Yeah, there, huh? that car was off one deal, by the way. Just saying, start the YouTube channel. Yeah. I'm gonna say which one just now. Hey, I need some of that. I need some of that. <laughs> now nah, we'll be this one, inshallah, bro. Yeah, I mean, I mean. Uh bro, back to the back to the beef. Yeah. Obviously, my boy Chief Matt. Yeah. You Chief and, Matt. You you and he him, him had some back. I would I would say back and forth. I feel like it's just y'all niggas obviously talking about him mm. because of some situation that happened offline. Mm, yeah. And everyone in the comments always asking, put Chief Matt on this, mm. put Chief Matt on this. But obviously, you haven't been able to patent the collab because of some situations that happened behind closed doors. So I want to understand, like, the, but just like, just take me through the timeline, like okay. where it started. So it started. And how it ended up to how it is now, where you can't collab together. Okay, cool. So Chief Matt pulled up, like, let me tell you, way back. Chief Matt pulled up to Joburg. That time they were hot. Like, this is probably the time I was probably like five K subs. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. The, the three fine guys that was the lit. Yeah, I think they did some Puma deal, or whatever. They came to Castle, 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 Castle Light. Yeah, yeah. So they came to Joburg. To do that, what what the deal? And I was like, "Yo, bro, you guys are here. Let's collaborate." Blah blah. blah this, obviously, at that time, I'm a small YouTuber. They're looking yeah. even like, you know, what I'm saying, they only look at me like that. They're just like, "Ah, bro, shout out. Ah, we can't do it." Blah, 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 blah. I left it. <laughs> you know, what I'm saying, "Ah, that's dude, bro." I was like, "Damn, you know, I'm a small YouTuber. You get it?" Yeah. So I managed the situation, and now fast forward, I think probably like six to six to eight months later. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Became Messi's biggest, and then after that, we said, "Okay, cool, let's go to to Durban." Yeah. No, I mean no, Cape Town. Cape Town, yeah. Coming to Cape Town, came to Cape Town, we're like shit. Now that we're in the city, everyone is like, yo, call everybody with the Cape Town YouTubers. Yeah. You know how we hit you up? We hit up everybody. Like mm. we don't even like the dog anyone who's doing their shit. Not even TikTokers, everybody. That's how we match days and everything. Yeah. Hit up everybody that's in the city that's making some form of motion. Anything, music, everything you do, we hit you up like yo bro, let's work. Let's do something. You know what I'm saying? The people love to see let's yeah. do it. You know what I'm saying? Shop, we hit up Chief Man. Like, yo, bro, we're shooting da 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 pull up. He's like, ah, I thought always I'm busy on this day, I'm gonna come on this day. So let's say you tell me I'm coming on Tuesday. I bet, cool. We say, okay, Tuesday we're shooting with Chief Matt. Done, sit, done. Cool, Tuesday comes, ghost. Don't message us nothing, blue. This shit, we went, that day wasn't even that deep. We went on all our day. We said, okay, let's get busy, let's work. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We minded it, went back to Joburg, called it a night. Next time we came to Cape Town, second time. Yeah. Landed in Cape Town, yo. Uh, let's hit up the people. We even forgot about the reminds us. Hey, they didn't come. He didn't make it. He didn't even tell us like, yo, I can't make it. Blah blah. Whoop, there's nothing. Just left us there. Message him like, yo, bro. Um, we're in Cape Town again. We know we couldn't link the last time. Are you free again? He's like, ah, dog, away. Let's do it again, bro. This day, oh, I'm coming on. Let's say Thursday. Shop. Same thing happened again. And uh, you know, I understand if someone can wake up in the morning and be like, yo, bro, I'm sick. Oh, yo, something came up. Like, yeah, I can't shoot no more. I can't do it. Left us on red mm. again. Now at that same time we should we say okay cool let's just shut another video. People were asking us questions and stuff like that. So now one of the questions were which YouTubers won't you collaborate with? Yeah. Now it's like think of like what's supposed to shoot with Chief Matt that day. That nigga's ghost can't hear of him. Nothing. We said no, no, we were blunt. We said honestly that we're not gonna do a video with Chief Matt because that we invited him twice and like he's not a man of his word. He just went ghost on us. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? So like we told the people, oh no, in the moment, because at, at the it happened that morning. So it's like a thing of like, dog, that's what on our mind. So we just spoke about it. We're like, that we rented out. So no, we're not gonna do a chief man because of ABCD. But we also mentioned a lot of other niggas too, like Reggie. We told like Reggie, okay, cool. There was an incident. Reggie, uh, it's a superstar, and also we're not gonna make a video with Reggie no more. This guy, this guy, all these people. You know what I'm saying? Everybody that we had some sort of like reason to behind it. We're like, okay, we're not gonna work with these people. Cause like also in a video, if they ask who you're not gonna work with, and you be like, no, I'd work with anybody. It's cool. Cause you probably would. I'd probably I'd work with anybody. I told people I work with anybody, but also it's a thing of like, if you want a genuine answer right now in that moment, I wouldn't work with this person because of this. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Mm. Cool. That situation passed. He saw the video. Yeah. After he saw the video, it's like, yo, bro. He sent this whole paragraph saying, yo, bro, I'm sorry. Da da da. Couldn't make it. Da da da. Apologize. But when you're back in town, let me know. Da da da. Like the message, left it there. Yeah. We didn't even reply. We didn't bother thinking. Mm -hmm. We left it. Cool. We then after that we came back to Joburg. I think. Now when I came back with you and I told you to link up Chief Matt for I think the twenty versus one or something. Twenty versus oh okay, that was recently, no? That yeah. was like last two months ago. Exactly. That's yeah. the time again. I was like, okay, cool. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's been a while. Yeah. Like it I, thought, I we didn't take it to heart or anything like that. Uh let's see if we can get Chief Matt. 
And obviously you start telling me, oh no, Chief Knight doesn't fuck with us because of A, B, C, D, F. Yeah. I'm like, dog, if there's anybody wasn't supposed to fuck with someone in that situation, it's more of us. Because mm. he flopped us twice. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? But 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 there was two other incidents though involved though. Mm. The mukbang mm. with I was ghost and and just Daddy G. Okay, yeah. I don't know. Was, I don't know who was it that got angry in the in the in the mukbang. And they were saying, nah, I don't mess with Chief Matt. I don't know if it was ghost. I don't know if you remember that, that mukbang when you eat in the kota. There was another mukbang where you guys were sitting in a room and there was a dark room and then, and then they asked the question about Chief Matt and then Ghost or, Ghost or someone, I can't remember who exactly it was, mm. but Ghost got angry and Ghost was saying all this magic like, nah, if I see that nigga, all of this, all of, all of that. Yeah. So that that is probably a part of the, 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 the incident that you left out. Cool. Yeah, even, even, like, but even with that, it's like, at the same time, that's ghost. Even if, like, let's say we're in the room right now. Let's say, so, like, the thing of, like, okay, cool. Let's say I say, like, shit about Chief Matt right now. Yeah. And then you're like, okay, yeah, cool. What did you do was wrong. Or whatever. Like, whatever. You, even if you don't back it up. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Now, just because we're all Jobo YouTubers, you say, okay, I'm not going to work with none of them. Although I say some shit in the past, my yeah. shit, like, I did, like, we said the real stuff. Even if I said anything wrong. Mm-hmm. Like, even if I said, oh, no, Chief Matt did ABCD, D, ABC. You know what I'm saying? Like, even if I said, like, Whatever we did yeah. or said, it's a thing of like, bro, first of all, we have never said it to his face. Yeah. So like, because that would be rude. That would mm-hmm. be disrespectful. You know what I'm saying? And most of the time when we do shit or say shit on the internet, it's a thing of like, um, like I was saying at the beginning with the pranks and everything. Yeah. Everything is exaggerated. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like even like, because the thing of like, look, with the beef, you're also asking about the beef situation with Coast and all of that. Everything we do is exaggerated to the T because of like, the, we want to entertain the people. I get you, I get you. But say for instance, nah, me and you have this understanding where if we beef, then it's sort of like exaggerated. Then we both understand each other. But now, a third party like that gentleman sitting over there, he's now chilling. He doesn't know that it's exaggerated like that. He doesn't know that it's just, oh, acting for mm. YouTube. If you're going to approach him in a certain type of way and talk crazy about him on the internet in a certain kind of way, isn't he going to take offense to it? Because he's not in your circle to understand what you, what, what how you handle things. You know what I'm I mean? I'm going to give you an example. Uh, what's it called? Ghost Luby beefed with uh, Blackie and Lucas Raps. Yeah. They did the whole diss track on them, blah, blah, blah. He never, bro, he has probably never spoken to those guys ever before they did the diss track yeah. and everything. He did it, went good, went viral. They all responded. They're like, like, oh no, ghost is this, oh no, this is just ABC, all those stuff. Yeah. And then after that, they spoke about it, chopped about it. They're like, oh, why did you do this? You know what I'm saying? Like, all these things are just confrontation. Like, if you don't fuck with what we did or a certain thing like that, you know what I'm saying? If you're really like a person, like if you really cared, like if I don't like what EB did, like let's say even if I don't know EB, I'll tell like, yo, EB, I don't like what you did. Yeah. But now if I'm going to tell all EB's friends that, yo, I don't like EB, and then I must expect their friends to go and tell him. That's also like, the, I'm in the same group chat as you. As you going to tell the internet. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Mm. It's like, there's no like, there's no bigger man in the picture. Yeah, I, I get, but what I'm saying is like, it's not about going to speak to the person. It's more about how you done it. Mm. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Like, if I am not friends with you like that, no? And you have to come to me today and smack me on my head. Mm. I'm not going to rock with that, bro. But if you do it to your home, you understand, you guys have that understanding yeah, where you guys are both on the like same page. I was page. saying, I do understand. I do understand where you're mm-hmm. coming from. You know what I'm saying? But all the things we said and done in those videos is like, um, how do I say it? Chain reactions of he's doing. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Because mm. if he came the first day and linked up with us and shot the video as promised, I don't ever think we're ever going to say Chief Matt is ABCD. Mm. Imagine now, like, like yesterday, yesterday we shot. Imagine yesterday, like even like you know, K is always late. Yeah. You have this dad, okay. You even asked me 10 times, don't come late. Don't come what, late. Because you know that's how I am. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Mm. Now, if I told you, what's some call, like yesterday, yo, let's shoot. And I was like, cool, cool. And then I, I bailed out on you. I'm like, yo, dog. After, like, like, I let you go set up everything. Like, you got the blind date, everything ready. And after that, I don't even message you. Tomorrow, I message you. I'm like, yo, bro, how did I couldn't make it yesterday? Let's do it again today. And then today, I don't come again mm. and I just went ghost yeah. and let's say the podcast comes like this now and then they ask you yo which YouTuber don't you like 
You're gonna say me first. Yeah, I get you. Why? Mm-hmm. Because dog, as, 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 as thing is, as the thing of like, I'm not gonna say any random guy that I've never met in my life mm. or I haven't had any bad experiences with. The only guy that come to a pop of your head is Chief Mad, right? Because he did that. Mm. You get what I'm saying? So now everything, like every time, because the people are gonna ask those questions. Yeah. Which you should be not gonna work with. You know what I'm saying? And you have to give them the answer that they want. So the only person you can think of right now is Chief Matt because also us, the, the, the worst thing about us is we work with every person. Yeah. Whether you have 5K subs, whether you have 2K subs, whether you don't even have a video. I think, bro, YouTubers in Joburg, we'll start the YouTube channel with you, your first video. Yeah. You I've get what I'm saying? It. I've seen it, yeah. So it's not like, we, there's no one that we would never work with. Like someone can, like, Reggie. Reggie has said so much shit about me on the internet, like on so many videos. Mm. Who's the worst YouTuber? Ah, King Omar. His videos are ass. Who's the, 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 the King Omar? He's the, 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 the. So, hey, Baba, a brand deal comes. Hey, Poison, I'm looking for a YouTuber that does ABCD. Okay, do you want to use this guy? Oh, no, this guy's not good. Okay, okay, I have Reggie for you. Hook him up still. Why? Because we understand we're doing, it's like, it's, the, it's YouTube. But that, but I, I, I get you. It's YouTube. I, I, I get most of your points. One point I don't get, and one point I think we'll have to disagree on is the point of, Joburg have an understanding. That's not that's not that's maybe not how we do it in Cape Town. Like in but, Cape Town, I can't name you one big YouTuber that's doing fake pranks in Cape in in Cape Town. But it's also very thingy because like there's not much YouTubers in Cape Town. Yeah. There's so a, if you're telling a, me there's only five YouTubers in Cape Town, all five YouTubers doing the same thing, it doesn't help. Now give us to a pedestal where there's hundred. Mm. Now obviously now the thing is saturated now. Mm. You get what I'm saying? So like that doesn't really happen because like we t- bro like technically we are also Cape Town YouTubers. You get what I'm saying? Why, why you say that? Because of like um although we're not in Cape Town, if you check our stats and audience bases, there are also a lot of people that watch us from Cape Town. Yeah, I get you. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? So like they're still on YouTube watching the pranks as South African YouTubers. We don't have to actually be saturated. Oh, you're from Joe, but you do this. You're from Durban, you do nah. We're all South African YouTubers at the end of the day. Matter of fact, we're African YouTubers. But, but there's different mindsets. Yeah, no, I get that. If you, if you go, I get that. The same way, Joburg, bro, bro, the same way how even like, dog, I'll never do a certain video with Tata Rambedi because he's obviously older and he has like, I have some form of respect towards him. Yes. And ABCD, mm-hmm. the same way how I want to have a video with Ghost. But at the end of the day, it's a thing of like, bro, we have never met Chief Matt in person. But the only experiences we have, point, exactly. But I'm saying the only experiences we have with him were bad experiences. Yeah. But now he's out there making look, making it look like okay, no, we the bad guys. Although we we were called we bad because we called him out on the shit that he did. But it's the thing of like, bro, at the end of the day, bro, if you're a man of your word and you said, okay, cool, I'm gonna come collab with you guys, and you came, we were never gonna be in this situation. So as that in that point in that matter, you're like, okay, cool, I did, I did, and then they, I did should do shit wrong for these guys. You know what I'm saying? I fell on them twice. Once is cool. Yeah. Twice, it's like, oh, bro, what the fuck? Yeah. You get what I'm saying? The first, first time when it was Joe, but I understood completely. I'm like, shit, I'm, I'm probably nobody to this guy. You say, I get it. Mm. Second time, you agreed. Third time, you agreed. Like, even if you ask, K- KB came here on his own to Cape Town, hit up Chief Matt on a video idea. And then Chief Matt is like, okay, cool. I'll get back to you. Dog, we from Joe, but we here for probably a week or two. You can't tell me you get back to me and then you get back to me uh, three months later and after that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, bro, if you're going to do something, say you're going to do it. At the same time, if you don't want to, say you don't want to. Mm. So don't, make, don't put our hopes up. Like, at the end of the day, bro, we do this more for the audience, less for this. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, even for us, it's more business. Like, cool, EB, EB wants a video. Ah, dog, it'll be dope for the Cape Town audience. Oh, dope for my audience. Let's do it. Yeah. They love EB. I love EB. I watch these videos. Let's do it. You, you know it. what I'm saying? Okay, no, that's it. They love Evie. Okay, okay. Yeah. <laughs> but like, it's it's never a thing of like, Evie is gonna be my best friend in the future. Let me help him out. No, even if Evie tells me, ah, I don't wanna be your friend no more. I don't wanna be in this video no more. I say, ah, babe, that's your thing. But 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 one thing, one thing. I don't know. You, Matt's probably gonna be upset to me for saying this. Mm-hmm. One thing with Matt now, in order for him to make a video with you, he has to be homies with you. Yeah, no, I get that. That's different for him. Like, you can look at it in the business aspect, but yeah. him. He's, he's, he's. I understand that hundred percent, bro. There's so much people like even with my Smash Your Pass videos and stuff like that. Like, um, if you want to be on a Smash Your Pass video, anyone can go on it. Yeah. You want to be on a Mafia video? I'm like, nah, dog. You can't just be on Mafia. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Mm. But now, if I tell you, okay, cool, I'm gonna put you on a Mafia video, and then 
whenever I shoot mafia, I never invite you. Now it's like, ah, oh, dog. You I told me you're gonna put me in a mafia yeah, video. Like even if you told, like, dog, there's, there's even Hunse, just that it's the same way. Yeah. Just Daddy G, you will not collaborate with someone if he has never chilled with you at least one day. Mm. So if I want to collab with just Daddy G, you'll be like, yo, bro, let's chill. Or meet him at somewhere, you chill for a day or hour or whatever and stuff like that. After you chill with that, dog, getting a video from Hunse is easy now. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Even, dog, I'm telling you, Hunse, I asked him for a collab so many times, long time. This is like before I even became a YouTuber. Dog, it's like, it was always like, my, obviously it was huge at that time. We chilled a few days at UJ, you know, we chilled, we chilled, we chilled, we chilled. Now, Hunse for a video. Ha. You don't yeah. even have to tell him yeah. on the day, two hours before he'll pull up for you. Mm. You get what I'm saying? And I understand, bro. Like, like I was saying, bro, I understand his point of view and his outlook on it, bro. Yeah. But at the end of the day, the fact of the matter is, the thing still stands is the fact that, bro, he did promise. And the worst part about it, like, he didn't only promise me. Every time, like, it's even a thing of, like, every time we come to Cape Town, we get someone else to do it. It's so like, I'm like, oh, I thought, I know, next time, last time I messaged Chief Matt, bro, he bailed out on me, though. I don't think I'm going to message him again, bro, because, like, now it's like, I'm begging a guy, you yeah. know, and I want to force things. Mm -hmm. Ghost will be like, ah, I don't know, nah, I want to work with him, really, bro. Let me message him. Ah, Mice. Ah, I'm going to come, don't worry, bro, I'm going to shoot with you guys on Wednesday, bro, that's the day I'm free. I right, bet, cool. Mice. And just like, ah, dog. If he did it to one person, I'm going to say, just I don't like that guy, I don't like his content. It's cool. Dog, like, bro, me all lie, bro. If someone just, bro, there's so many, bro, there's so many TikTokers, bro. Bro, like, yo, I can go list the name of people. Don't you want to be in my video? Oh, no, I don't like your brand because you associate yourself with Smash Your Pass. I don't want to be a part of those videos. Cool. I get you. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? I respect that person. Nah, like, oh, no, I'm coming to a shoot on Saturday, bro. Don't worry. You dog, you know how hard it is to plan a shoot, yeah. bro. It's not like it's not like dog. If it was a TikTok video, I can understand, bro. Mm. But like if you actually a shoot, bro, like dog, you know, like imagine the blind dad didn't pull up. Now the girl, you got her there, whatever, you drove pet, everything, like eh, hey, Omar didn't pull up. Mm. Even just imagine you set up everything here. Ah, Omar doesn't show up. Dog, you're gonna feel some type of way, yeah. dog. You get what I'm saying? So I'm just like, dog, it's dope. Like with me, like I never beef with anybody. Everybody knows that in my area, come in, everybody, I don't beef with nobody. Like we, you can you can do me shit. Look at you even said it, bro. No matter how hard someone do you shit, bro, you shouldn't walk around with that thing of like, nah, this nigga did fucked up shit to me. Yeah, I'm gonna speak to him. I'm gonna do shit with him. Cause bro, life is crazy. A lot of the crazy things that can happen in life. Yeah, you get what I'm saying. So like you're gonna walk around with that sour look, and that person that you, that probably did you shit will never even think of like, oh shit, I did that nigga shit. They moved on. They it? moved on. Mm -hmm. Now you're out there holding grudges. Oh, I'm not gonna dog. Come on, bro. You know what I'm saying? I get you. But from my understanding, though, apparently you guys only eat him up twice, though. But yeah, we eat him up twice. Yeah, that, as, as a collective, that's yeah. what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. What I'm trying to say is, though, like, it's not even like the thing is, we have such a broad group. Yeah, Lebs and Lisa will come to Cape Town. Yo, bro, I'm in Cape Town. The thing is, the thing is about us, we so connected, bro. They're like, we call each other. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yo, it'll be like, Lebsa, well, and it's a thing of like, you'll never even know that, ah, dog, this guy asked me for this. Mm. He'll be like, yo, bro, I'm in Cape Town, bro. Who do you think I should hit him? Ah, dog, I'll send him, like, me, I'll even send people their numbers. I'll send him, oh, Ibi's in Cape Town, bro, hit him, maybe we can do a video with him. Yeah. You know, stuff like that. So I'll be like, oh, no, hit up Chief Man. Like, and it'll be someone that you won't even think I know. He'll hit you up. He'll tell you, hey, I'll even tell him, hey, dog, watch out, dog, Chief Man probably won't come. Yeah. You know, you have to be honest with people. Mm -hmm. You know, they mustn't get the hopes up. So like same thing, bro. Everyone will tell you, ah, dog, I hit him up in the DMs. He might, he blue tick me. Dog, mm -hmm. Instagram is beautiful, dog. You on a general request, bro. Don't don't enter the message if you don't want to work with no one. Leave it there. Now you're gonna little guy on red is like, dog, you pushing someone down, bro. Doesn't make sense, bro. Or just be like, nah, I'm cool, mm -hmm. done. Okay, but yeah. Sure. But right now, do you have any beef with Chief Math? No. Nah, bro, I don't have beef with nobody, bro. Like even if Chief Math has to be like, yo, maybe. Yo, let's do a video today. I do it. And he's not gonna be on some no um shit of like oh, I'm not gonna come there with my full energy. I've never met the guy. I can't be a foul, bro. I'll find out. You find out, bro. When if if we chill, bro, chill, man. You can find out he's my homie now. Yeah. Cause he's a dope person. Yeah. But I don't know that. Or you can find that nigga ass, bro. Like I I'm probably never ever gonna hit him up again. You yeah. know what I'm saying? I could. But you never point. know. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? So I can't judge someone that I've never met. If mm. I've met and chilled with you, I can tell you, ah, I'm not going to do a video with this guy. Mm, mm. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. <clears throat> okay. That's interesting. That was a very long segment, very deep, very, very detailed. Yeah. I feel like people have been wanting to understand why you guys don't work together and I'm sure they got the answer from that. Yeah, man. Mm -hmm.
Moving along, though, bro. You um, mentioned that the, the YouTubers in Joburg are very connected. So you always obviously have been on both sides. Like you come to Cape Town often. You stay mm. in Joburg. Mm. Why do you think that the Joburg creators are more than the Cape Town ones? What do you think um, for that is? I feel like with Cape Town, um, I don't know how to see it necessarily, but it's two factors of it. That I, the way I see it is like people here are comfortable, like they're chilling. In which way? Like there's no, like if you tell someone, cool, be a YouTuber today. I'm like, yo, I have to edit. I have to shoot. I have to uh, think of an idea. Da, da, da. Yeah. Sounds like a lot of work. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying? So if you don't have that drive, that push, like, yo, I, I want to do this. Mm. I need to do this. They'll never do it. Whereas, like, in Cape Town, niggas are just, like, chilling. They're relaxed. Same thing as, like, Pretoria. Yeah. In Pretoria, there's not a lot of YouTubers in Pretoria. Why? Because niggas are relaxed. They university kids, you know, they just came out. They want to they enjoy vibes. They want a normal team. life. They want to enjoy You know what I'm saying? They yeah. want to relax. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Now, there is obviously one, two people that want to, like, you know, shit, I want to be a YouTuber or whatever. You know? But, like, to actually drive it and implement it, bro, like, you have to be able to have that shit. I want to do it. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? So, like, with Cape Town, I just, it's it's slow. Mm. It, it's slow here. Like, okay. dog, in yeah. Joburg, bro, like, if it's Joburg, we can, we can shoot five videos a day. Boom. And it's like, I'm not talking about five videos, like, no more five I'm talking about five view, one hour videos. Niggas will be like, ah, dog, it's the same people, same office. Dog, what the hell? We shot it all in one all day. All in one day, yeah. Bro, yeah, shit. Just like when we were there at that, um, at that place there, that, that Airbnb we at now. We yeah. We made videos at one day. Dog, from everybody shoots, bro. Mafia. Dog, mafia. Like everyone will get a video. We leave there. We eight YouTubers. Everyone will get a video one day. Mm. Nice. Tomorrow we'll do the same thing. Mm-hmm. Now if it's like Cape Town. But I know I also get it, bro. Life is slow here, dog. In Cape Town, dog, people wake up four, five o'clock, yeah. Four or five o'clock in the in the afternoon. Yeah, in Cape Town. Ah, no way, not me, bro. Nah, certain, that's you. Certain people, man. I'm just saying, dog. I can see it. Dog. People will say, "Oh, no. dog, I'm going to the club." Niggas will say, "I'm leaving my house at one o'clock. I'm going to the club at one a.m." Hey, man, it's supposed to come in back. <laughs> Joe, you leaving your house one a.m. Uh, you won't come back. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So yeah. it's all those things of like, there's a little, there's a bit of a delay. Yeah. Same thing also with the music shit. Mm. It's a bit of a delay. Obviously, Joe is like, bro. Joe is. Fast chop, 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 chop. That's why all the all the freaking artists from all around the world, I mean all around South Africa, whenever they get some form of blow up, they go to Joburg. Because they want to maintain it. Because it's wanna, fast. Yeah, fast yeah. It's quick. Yeah. You can get faster results. Same thing what I was telling you. If you're in Joburg, you'll be gone. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Because mm. the thing of like, if you want to shoot every day, you can shoot. In Cape Town, if you want to shoot every day, you can't shoot. Yeah, you can't always. There are days you know, uh, today, uh, mm. you know, there will be no one outside. Yeah, I, I can't shoot nothing. Mm. Nowadays, YouTubers could talk we you know what I'm saying? Mm. So totally get you, bro. Now moving away from the YouTube. Yeah. Let's talk about the personal life, bro. Yeah. I heard you had you had a girlfriend. you 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 chill around a lot of girls. You made videos with lots of girls. I've seen you with King Luvia. Yeah, I don't know what's yeah. happening between you guys there. But I see you guys vibing on the videos, showing love that TikTok it went viral. Nothing last yet. year. And um just bare honeys, bro. Bare honeys you've been what are the mummy say? There's one in, 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 in specific. Yeah. I don't know. Her name is on, on, Onyeka. Onikwa, yeah. Onikwa. Onikwa. Yeah. Pardon my, my pronunciation there. Yeah. So you guys were dating and then you weren't dating. And now we see TikToks at certain times pop up. So you guys together or you guys not together? What's what's going on? <sighs> That's a it's, a com- sign, it's a complicated life you live in. You know what I'm saying? Life is a bit of like ups and downs yeah. and stuff like that. Yeah, it's just a crazy life we live in. I just feel like t- the truth. It's a very toxic relationship, if I should say. Toxic, very, very toxic. So, so, so did you guys? You guys started dating, and she's from? She okay. She's from Cape Town initially, mm-hmm. but I met her in Pretoria when she was studying in Pretoria. Yeah. But now she graduated, and now she moved to Cape Town. Mm. Now you see how thick it is now. Mm, yeah, she's I staying you. in Cape Town. I'm staying in Joburg. It's like. <sighs> So, like, the times you guys do see videos of us together and all of that, it's because maybe she's in Cape Town. Oh, oh, I'm in Cape Town, or she's in Joburg. You know what I'm saying? Because like, we still have that, like, you know what I'm saying? The bond. Yeah. Because, like, you know, like, you know, like, we hate each other or whatever. So, you guys didn't end on bad terms? Mm, the question needs to be in, but... <laughs> so, you guys, are you still... That's what I'm trying to find out now. Are we're you not, dating, we're not dating. You guys are seeing each other. But we're not also seeing each other. But also, we're not single. But are you linking other honeys? Hmm, very interesting question. That's a very <laughs> <laughs> so you are linking other honeys. 
What is linking other honeys? <laughs> linking to honeys, being with honeys, doesn't you feel a type of way when you're filming videos with, with like Luvia, for instance, and other people? Yeah, man, but like, I know the day I'm single. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So, but I don't know, bro. That relationship, I don't know what's going on there, bro. So, so would Bad. you be would you be comfortable if you saw with another nigga? Obviously not. But also, I don't think I'll like piss on it. You won't be like you won't be angry about it. Like I'll probably be angry about it, but I'm not gonna be out there like, yo, what the fuck? This like, cause then like saying like, dog, I actually want you to be my girl or whatever. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? With me, it's like, bro. We can be cool, like what little baby said, bro. Like I'm a big little baby friend. But when I see you, you are mine. When we're not together, you ain't mine, bro. Oh, and she's fine with that as well, bro. Like I don't know how to explain it. It's just yes, complicated. This, this compli- you know, you know, like when like you like someone so much and yeah. the company so mm-hmm. much. It's like it's not like them. They can do whatever, or whatever. But it's like, um, how do I say this? In a way that she won't kill me. <laughs> hey, choose your words wisely, bro. Yeah, this is, I'm thinking long and hard, bro. <laughs> but what I'm just trying to say is at the end of the day, bro, we're not dating initially. Like, we're not dating. Like, okay, we're dating, blah, yeah. blah, with this. But because we've been together for such a long time, it's like we haven't had that, like, separating fact. Like, we haven't been separated for that long to be like, okay, yeah, actually, it's not working out. Like, let's not continue whatever mm-hmm. we're doing. But also at the same time, it's like, She's going to get mad if I'm with other girls. I'm going to get mad if she's with other guys. Uh, I see, I see. So basically, a Gen Z relationship, the new age relationships, where you're together, but you're not really together. Ah, dog, me, I'm but single, you make it though. feel like you are together. Now all the hands are going to be out there. This person, I'm single, guys. Please, you're single. don't stress me. But on that topic, though, um, Cape Town Hans, who's your, who's anyone you have your eye on? Anyone you have a crush on? If you had to mention one, one Instagram, TikTok, crush, social media, Cape Town, name one. And I'm also one for Joburg as well. And one for PTA. <laughs> I don't know. I don't actually have a Cape Town one here. None at all. Only because. Hey, Cape Town Hans. Yo, they're nice. I won't lie. They're very nice. But hey, it's, it's very scary. Hey? Why? Because all the times I've came, well, all the time I came to Cape Town, it's um, either I'm with Onikwa or like, if I do link other hands, it's like most of them are from Joburg. Yeah, but but I'm not saying you have to link with someone. Mm. I'm saying you're chilling at your home in Joburg. You're scrolling in your timeline. You see this girl. You're like, yo, she's from Cape Town. I kind of like her. I have a crush on her. That's what I'm trying to understand. There's a just lot. The internet. Just, just won't stop. Just, just, name, a, just name one. Nigga, I even got a... S- <laughs> there's a lot of lists, man. There's a lot of them, bro. Like, yo, there's a lot, bro. There's, like, I wouldn't mind dating. Mm. That list will not end. Um, but with me, it's like, that's just like based on your outlook. And like, outlook, yeah. I never did you based on your outlook. Yeah. Like, you have to be dope actually to chill with and stuff like that. But if we're just talking about based on outlook, you're. Um, give, me, give, me, give me one or two. Let me give you a name. Mm. Uh, let me say Mbali. What Mbali? Um, yeah. The one that's been on the, on the videos with all of us. Yeah. 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 Uh-huh. But no, that's the problem. But I'm, I'm not going to get into it. That's the vi- it's just the video. I don't give a fuck, bro. My girl can't just be on everyone's YouTube channel, bro. That's crazy. But. But then, hey man, she's not. She wasn't on my girl at the time, so she, if she like, you know, what I'm saying, trying to yeah. body, if she trying to do something. But in body, I don't think she likes me though. Why? Because I've chilled with her a couple of times, and like, you know, you can feel the vibe. Mm, if she's feeling you, know? you if she's not feeling it. But she seems very much to herself though. She seems very. Yeah, it's like I feel like it's not even about she's not feeling me. It's the thing of like I feel like she's still not still not over her ex or whatever. But like, she, well, she was just talking a lot about her ex boyfriend, hey. And we sure. and we spoke about it we were like even there's pressure here, ne? Yeah, there's a lot of pressure. Yeah, so it's that type of thing on. But I feel like with time I do when I'm done manipulating the you know what I'm saying? Yeah. She'll be yeah. she'll be over the X. Mm. Who else? Who else? There's this hand named Boiti. Do you know what hand named Boiti? Nah, I don't know. I don't know. In Cape Town. I don't think she's like but she stays in Cape Town right now. Mm. But I don't think I think she's been here for varsity or whatever. But it's Han on Instagram. Her name is Boise. Yo, she's nice. Okay. One last yeah. one. <sighs> one last one. One last one. Who's in Cape Town? Give me a list of people. Not Luvia. You and Luvia linking up dog, videos. No. The only issue with Luvia is, dog, ah, dog, uh, I just made a video. Hey, meet my girlfriend with Luvia. This other one. Ah, dog. Ah. There's too much people making ah, videos. Dog. Everyone got a TikTok with her. Ah, now it's like I must be. That's my hand. Ah, it's bad. <laughs> 
<laughs> but Lil Vicky is cool though. She's dope. Yeah. She's very dope, man. But I don't know, man. You got no one else from Cape Town? Yeah, no one else from Cape Town, bro. And celebrities, like big celebrities in, in, in the whole of South Africa. Anyone that you that you're vibing with. Slowly, dog. Oh, it's time to got a new GLE, boy. Mm. Yes. So you got you gotta go Passage on. Passage your princess for life, boy. Don't lie, dog. I'll sit there. Mm. Let her group my thighs and everything. I'm joking. <laughs> Chill out, bro. <laughs> Chill out. Yo, but I was in going it's crazy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, who else celebrity wise? Yo. Waffles, waffles, yo. Damn. Oh, she got money, money, hey. She got money, money. You gotta yeah. go order, dog. Yo. Gotta drop more videos. Mm. So I have to go to Coachella just to shoot a YouTube video. Yeah, I get that, bro. But yeah, that's interesting. I see. I, yeah. I, I understand your taste now. Mm. See me, I'm a taken man, but obviously I'm I'm just. Okay, what's my taste? Since you understand it. You never mentioned one colored girl. So you like black girls mainly? I don't think it's because I like black girls, man. I just feel like I'm more exposed to black girls. Yeah, same Because if you're going to tell me now, one colored hand, that's like TikTok or thing. Okay, now answer that one. No, but I'm saying you tell me who it is. I don't know them. Oh, you don't know? You don't Oh, you don't know? You don't see them? Mm. Oh, I get you. I get you. I get you. Luvia? Luvia's colors. <sighs> Luvia's still. Like, well, outlook wise, I'll still. Care, like, she's colored, but like, I'll still put her like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. I get you. I get you. I get you. I don't, I don't, I don't want you to say that. Because mm-hmm. niggas in Cape Town are very. Yeah. Feel about about um certain communities. Okay. <laughs> Moving along, bro. One last thing I want to ask you. I watched your video with um No Chill God. No Chill, yeah. Yeah, you obviously your top five YouTubers. Yeah. I want to give you another opportunity. To say my top five YouTubers. Top five YouTubers. Ah, don't, don't do that to me. Say top five. That that you watch and you like. Doesn't have to be your homies. Just that okay. you're watching. Like, for instance, I'll put Chief Matt in my top five because I watch Chief Matt and I know it's anything, it's A1. Chief Matt is also dope, eh? A lot of people watch Chief Matt. I don't really watch him personally. Why? Because of the incident or just in general? I it's think, to be honest, I feel like it's because of the incident, if I'm being truly honest. But that means you took it personally, though. Like, it was me, it's like, bro. But also, it's not consistent. I feel like with me, with me is like dog. If that's, I have a lot of times where I have seasons. Okay, I can watch this guy. I used to, bro. I used to watch three fine guys like crazy. You know what I'm saying? Mm. And after he went to his own channel, I still used to watch him and Abu's channel. Yeah, you guys like crazy, like dog. You know what I'm saying? Drop the video, I watch it. Drop a video, I watch it. But if you can stop uploading for two months, bro, for me to get back to watching your videos, it's just like <sighs> I don't think it's two months though. It's not that long. Mm. I think it does maybe three weeks max. Yeah. But he's a big man also. Chief Matt is 26, man. He's ending life. Yes, yes. There's nothing to what say. What do you mean he's, uh, he's ending life. life? He's ending life. You don't know what he does in his free time. You don't know if he has a job. Do you know what I mean? Nah, it takes a day to make a video, dog. But his editing is A1. His editing takes time, though. Nah. Like, his editing is crazy. Have you it seen, you seen it that? It is crazy, but like, at his level, it is right now. For, it doesn't take long for him to edit the video. You think so? Shouldn't take him long. Because he's done so many of them. Okay, I hear you. I hear you. That's should I, like I wouldn't say it takes him an hour, but it should like in like if you want if you wanted to, in a day you can edit job. I mean edit shoot and job. Okay, but your top five though. My top five YouTubers in South Africa. Yeah. Um, that you enjoy watching. Recently, I started enjoying. Quick though, not like you gave it on no ch- no. No, because but I have to think about it, bro. Like okay. I genuinely have to sit down and think okay. about it, bro. Just, just give me, just give me as you wish. Okay, let me let me be, people that I actually watched in the recent, let's say, this last two months. Yeah, let me see that I've actually watched. Uh, like, five to one. Like in order. Me, it gives me a clean bracket because a lot of these YouTubers didn't drop in those last two months. <laughs> <laughs> um, top five. I definitely put. I don't, I'm not gonna say in order. I'm just gonna randomly just put okay. it. Okay. You know what I'm saying? But I definitely put. What's that guy's name there? Uh, the guy who did the traveling all the cities. The the Nico stuff. What's his name? His name is yo. He, he responded to me on um. Was it Tiamo? It starts with a T. It starts yeah. with a T. Let's actually let me get that nigga's name because I feel like he needs a honorable mention because the thing yeah, is that guy is crazy. Is, I also watched his one brand video. That was crazy. His one brand video where he survives on one. His name is Survive One. Tumiso and Kwana. Tumiso, Daisy. Tumiso is really dope. Yo, he dropped his one brand video 20 hours ago. Yeah. Yeah, he's pushing P now. No, and I watched that video already. So that's why I'm like, heaven. Mm, well, but that how many views that shit? It's on 10K in 20 <laughs> hours. I mean, it's not not obviously like crazy, crazy, but that's. Bro, they got 10K subs. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's dumb. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's, that's... <laughs> You get more all than your subscribers in 24 hours, but that's dumb. Yeah, yeah. You get what I'm saying? Mm. 
Um, Dumis is doing amazing right now, bro. That guy is literally doing me. I just pray he drops at least once a week because if he does that, he'll go crazy. Mm. At least, bro. Twice a week is when you're actually on your roll, but like once a week at least to pull that momentum. Yeah. Um, I see him becoming probably the biggest YouTuber in Cape Town. In South Africa. Sorry, not Cape Town. I I'll see. give him second biggest. Oh, obviously you want yeah. to. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna say another guy who's doing his thing on YouTube is um, Fago. You know Fago. Fago. Yeah. Nah, I never heard of him. F A G O. Yeah. F A. Private. P T L L T D boy. Ah, so I'm seeing yeah, he has he has the the little Uzi dreads. Yeah. yeah. He's doing his thing. Yeah, he's dope. Yeah, but he got a video that drops two minutes ago. Yo, he's pushing pin. Yeah. He's dropping an opus one in the afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> like the, the kids that come out of school, boom, boom. Yeah, <laughs> take that. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's he's also doing his thing. Eh? I, yeah. th- I'm not sure. I think he's from Dublin, so I'm not for sure where he's from. But also, he's pushing. Eh? Um, another YouTuber. Another YouTuber dog. Top five is actually very tough. Eh, just just give me any five, bro, that you actually watch. That you sit down, you switch on your television and be and like, I actually watch. I'm going to watch this nigga today. In South Africa, it's very hectic. Ibi the Kid is definitely out there, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I hope you guys are waiting for that one, bro. Like, I actually watch, I think I watch your videos the most out of all YouTubers in South Africa. You think so? Yeah, I'll put you, like, like if you have to, like, say, because obviously these guys and all of that is like, they, they dropped what's some call. Um, how can I say they job they I started watching them recently. Yeah. So I probably watched three or four videos of them. So they, they don't really count. But I just they, I see them and they're really dope. Mm. You know what I'm saying? But with you, it's like I watched watched you in the time I used to watch Boy Just Daddy G and them. Yeah. Until now. Mm. So I probably bro, like I watched so much of your interviews, bro. That's why I don't get fooled by any of your like your you tricks got, and shit. Because you know, I know everything you do, mm. you know. But I would say in South Africa, I watch your videos probably number one. Oh, that's crazy. It is crazy. Just because I really enjoy them. It's mm. like, like you were saying, but it's real content out there in the streets of Cape Town. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Like, even like with the blind dates and stuff like that, it's like, um, it's the actual video. Yeah, it's the actual video. There's no, there's no flow singing Yeah, anymore. like, there's no one there trying to impress the camera. Yeah, everyone's being real. No people. Mm-hmm. So that's really dope. Two more. You know? Um... Bro, like, the reason I'm putting this guy there is because that guy knows how to make you click on his video, whether you want to or you don't want to. Mm. Go Sluby. Go Sluby, yeah, yeah. Dog, you can see that this video is probably going to be um, a like, normal video. Oh, uh, no, whatever it is, bro. Yeah. You don't care, dog. He'll just title it and drop that time and you're like, what? No ways. Same Must time. Whatever it. you're doing, you have to you have to see if it's real mm. or you have to see if this really happened, bro. Mm. Like you'll click. And but I'd fail. Last one, we almost had the time. Last but not least, um YouTubers that one in South Africa. Yeah, I don't know, hey. You can leave that one out, leave that spot open. Mm, let's say, let's say, let's say, let's say, let's say, let's let me give a female YouTuber out there. Yo, all right, girls, you're not dropping, hey. Bali? Bali, Bali's been dropping, bro. Really? Yeah. I watched I think three of her videos, but I also yes. only watched her because I thought she was cute. To be yeah. honest. Bali, how much? How much have she on? Eleven k. When last she dropped? She dropped eight days ago. Before that, one month before. Okay, it's not really consistent, but she mm. is dropping though. She is dropping. Is she in Cape Town right now? Yeah, she's in Cape Town right now. Hmm. You trying to link up? Bro, let's finish the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, guys, this has been King Omar. Any yeah. last words, brother? Uh, I just want to say shout out to all the YouTubers that are out there doing their things, man. Really appreciate you guys. Keep pushing, keep working. You know what I'm saying? The bigger you guys get, the bigger we get. So if you guys need help to get bigger, uh, hit up Uber the Kid. He'll help you do some tips and tricks. And also, um, all the other YouTubers who are the pioneers of YouTube in South Africa, um, please, can you guys start picking up the cameras and start working? Because our CPMs are going down, mm-hmm. and that's because you guys are not dropping. So please. Wake up. I'm talking to you, just Daddy G. I'm talking to um, Target Tato is dropping, so that's dope. Zile, I'm talking to Ghost also, please, because mm-hmm. this thing of dropping after one month is not, is not it. Um, uh, who else is not dropping? Uh, Ato, I don't know if you know your password still, but <laughs> if you need help, I know a guy who can recover your password for you. Arjun, I don't know what's going on, but please, can you guys start dropping again? Please, uh, yeah. YouTube needs it. Okay. We need it for our podcast. For sure. Thank guys, you. this has been King Omar, The Kid Show. Shout out to you guys in the next one. Shout out to the kids.